our skin has a turnover cycle. This cycle refers to the time it takes that skin cells naturally fall off, which on average happens once every 28 days. It's said that if the skin cells don't fall off normally, it will interfere with the skin's absorption of the active ingredients from cosmetics and can cause various skin problems. In addition, it's said that the skin can become rough and dull, our makeup can get cakey, the regenerative ability of the skin decreases, and as the skin cells thickens, it can lead to acne. To help with solving and preventing such problems, it's necessary for us to exfoliate our skin. Among the many different types of exfoliating products, I believe many people choose to use peeling gels quite often as they work as a great physical removal method. Most peeling gel products work by applying them onto the face and leaving them to dry for about 3 minutes before massaging it with your fingers and then washing it off with lukewarm water. By doing this, the lumped up gel components absorb and remove the dead skin cells. At this time, it's said that the tiny pieces of junk appear due to the cellulose or carbomer contained in the peeling gel, which is a special ingredient that fixes on with a bit of friction. Although it appears like damaged peeling skin, there is no need to worry. These are said to be a moist type product that are not as dehydrating after use. For those with dry skin, since your skin is lacking in hydration, it's recommended to use a soft product, and it's recommended to be used once a week. You should also moisturize your skin immediately after exfoliating. In the case of oily skin, it's recommended to use a product that provides a deep cleansing effect or a product that contains BHA due to the sebum secretion. And it's recommended to use them 2 to 3 times a week. Please do take note that if they're not washed off thoroughly with water, they may cause skin trouble, so be careful. As for sensitive skin, since sensitive skin has poor resistance to external stimuli, so irritation should be minimized. It's said that it's best to immediately concentrate on moisturizing the skin with lotion and essence after use. As mentioned earlier, if your dead skin cells are not removed normally, it can interfere with the absorption of the active ingredients from your cosmetic product and causes various skin problems. Therefore, if you have concerns with skin problems or if you find your makeup getting cakey, it's recommended that you take care of your dead skin cells regularly.